So now, uh, if I pulled it up, if I made my income go up to like, let's say like 80,000, and I bring it on back over, now it's limiting the deduction that I have here. So if I go to my schedule one, you can check out that on the worksheet. So you can see what the phase out starts to be applied is. I won't go through the calculation. Obviously, you, you don't typically explain all the calc all the calculations to a to a client. The software can help you to understand and make sure that the calculations are properly being uh, calculated. But the general idea is that, is that yeah, you're going to get the student loan interest if your income is below a certain threshold. But then it starts to phase out as your income gets above a certain threshold, and then it caps out at like eighty five thousand or so where you don't get any benefit at all. And so if I bring it up to 85,000, then it has been eliminated. Okay, so then we can also, let's, let's say if we had a married couple. So now Mr. Anderson got married to Jane Anderson now. So 85,000. And now we've got the 2,500 has been applied again because if I go back to the schedule one and page two, We've got the 2,500 because the threshold is up to, you don't lose it all completely until you get to like 175,000. So if I brought the income, if I said, for example, wages and added a W2 number two, W2 w for the spouse. And I said, said we had another, we had another, uh, let's say 50, thousand that's gonna let's say 60 60 thousand and i pull that on over so we're still at the 2500 so it's still capping it out at the 2500 let's say we brought this up to 70 thousand for a total of 255 so now it's starting to uh reduce it now 2500 is being reduced and then if i bring it up you can just see the kind of the curve here as we adjust it. If I bring it up to 80,000 for uh, 165 total, then we're at uh, the, the 832. And then if I bring it up to something close to 175, which is going to be 80, 90,000, then I think it's going to be eliminated. So there it is. So you get the general sense of it on uh, the married side of things obviously the phase out thresholds typically being higher for married versus single